as we introduce another fake logical fallacy, the, the logical fallacy called spreading. There's no such logical fallacy called spreading. This is a lie. This is some bullshit that he made up, and he's introducing it to the public, you know, as if though this is something uh, legitimate, and it is not. Okay, this is disingenuous, and this is the signs of a man that has no morals and has no business in front of a camera to debate anybody. In order to have logic, in order to have morals, in order to have a belief system, you all must have principles. And this brother doesn't have any fucking principles. And the sad part about it, it is very disrespectful to the audience to do this shit. Listen to this shit. I um, want to keep this as respectful as possible, and I think um, there's going to be a lot of spreading and, uh, unfortunately, gish galloping in this uh, conversation. That's not something that I do. Uh, I want to keep this as respectful as possible, and I think um, there's going to be a lot of spreading and, uh, unfortunately, gish galloping in this uh, conversation. Um, that I do. Uh, I want to keep this as respectful as possible, and I think um, there's going to be a lot of spreading and, uh, unfortunately, gish galloping in this uh, conversation. Something that I do. Uh, I want to keep this as respectful as possible, and I think um, there's going to be a lot of spreading and, uh, unfortunately, gish galloping in this uh, conversation. Not something that I do. Uh, I want to keep this as respectful as possible, and I think um, there's going to be a lot of spreading and, uh, unfortunately, gish galloping in this uh, conversation. Chris is what you call an ultra-crepidarian, okay? That is a person who likes to critique and speak and make judgments outside of his expertise. You know what I'm saying? You know, uh, and, and that's crazy, you know what I'm saying? He likes to act as though he's an authoritarian on something. And the sad part about it, he falls beneath the most basic, minimal standards. You know what I'm saying? And that's just some real shit. The nigga is making up shit, you know, and, and it, it, it's, it's really, really foul, and it's fraud, and it's, and it's really disrespectful and insult to the intelligence of the opponent and worse, the audience. That is playing the audience is stupid. He know that you people don't know nothing about no logical fallacies. There's no such fucking logical fallacy as cause spreading. This is some shit that this clown nigga is making up, and it's just fucking sad. When you debating Chris Harris or having a dialogue with Chris Harris and his condescending and berating dialogue, you know, dichotomy, you understand what I'm saying? You know, when you when you having a discussion with this guy, you gotta pay close attention to him. And when he when he throws out bullshit like uh, this is spreading, and then he mix it with the real uh, 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 tech tactic called uh, the gish gallop, because the gish gallop is not even a logical fallacy. You understand? It's just a tactic. It's a disingenuous tactic. You understand what I'm saying? where a person throws out a barrage of information, mistruths and lies, and you are supposed, you are expected to unravel all of those lies. It becomes quite impossible, impossible to uh, break down these lies. You understand what I'm saying? All these lies, when a person throw you a hundred lies and you miss one, then he can use that one that you didn't, you didn't uh, uh, address and come back and, uh, uh, with the appearance that he won the argument. All just tactics, you understand what I'm saying? But this thing called spreading, there's no such fucking thing as spreading. It's something that he fucking made up, and that is the honest to God truth. And if the audience let him get away with that, then the audience is full of shit, and the audience need to be duped. And, and, you know, they need to be hoodwinked, duped, and, and, and everything else that comes with it. Um, so that's what I would like to have that conversation with respectful as possible. And I think um, there's going to be a lot of spreading and uh, unfortunately gish galloping in this uh, conversation. Faith, that's not something that I do. Uh, I want to keep this as respectful as possible. And I think um, there's going to be a lot of spreading and uh, unfortunately gish galloping in this uh, conversation. 
That's not something that I do. Um, I want to keep this as respectful as possible. And I think um, there's going to be a lot of spreading and uh, unfortunately gish galloping in this uh, conversation. Um Bullshit. Shut the fuck up. Shut your ass up. That's some stupid shit to say, bro. And I dare you sit up there and play on the intelligence of black people like that. Ain't no motherfucking such thing as no spreading. It's a goddamn shame, Chris Harris. You ought to be ashamed of yourself, bro. And you should be embarrassed, bro. I mean, it's sad that you have no backbone that you would sit up there and hold yourself and express your ignorance and your foolishness in front of the public like that.